It's my birthday. It's my birthday. Oh. I'm so sorry. Alright. I don't know what it is. I didn't even eat today yesterday. But um my face is really swollen today. Doesn't it look so swollen in my eyes as well? I should probably show you a <laughs> Did I have these things so much. Great start. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, random. But did you ever have um when you were younger did your parents have a drive safely? Um did your parents ever have like hymns they sang to you? I have a favourite one. Um I don't know what it's called, but I don't know what it's called as a friend. There is a friend for little children above the bright blue sky. A friend who never changes, whose love will never die. Our earthly friends may fail us and change, we change. This friend is always worthy of our dear name bears. Amen. I don't even know that's the right lyrics, but that's what I roughly remember. And I just love that song. I love it. Back. Had a shower. Um, wash my face. Don't forget the sunscreen. Better? I look a bit more presentable now. <laughs> um, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna head out into town quickly. Pop a, to pop a few things to get a few things um well not to get a few things I'm, I'm thinking of doing my nails um i don't really do them often the maintenance part like i get them done once and like i have to then i never do them again and then i do them again <laughs> um so yeah i'm that kind of person but we shall see Getting stronger bit by bit. Let's worship along with Austin French. This is a song that echoes Matthew eleven twenty eight, 28, where Jesus invites us to bring our burdens to him so that we can find rest for our souls. Come to me. So, um, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier, but I'm going to, I'm going to lunch with some friends. Um, I'm going to talk with Jesse and I'm going to meet Romy, my Mesa, from my sixth form days. It's, I was thinking about it earlier, but it's so strange when you think about like friends who've been around for like time, you know? And I think relatively to my life is not time, but I think 
when you think about how easy friendships break these days these days um, how easy friendships break generally then it's something so true we're not meant to carry it on our own just had to shazam that song for my phone because it was speaking the truth but yeah no what was i saying um you know it's just important to like um remember you know sometimes we get caught up in our own heads and our own minds and our own thoughts and it's like god is looking at us like i'm here talk to me speak to me i want to be there for you but you have to let me in you know and um, yeah, I think it's just a beautiful reminder that I literally, it's, he's the only one that can really carry our burdens, like, anyone who really wants to, do you know what I mean? Just imagine. I'm sure if it was you and, you and, you and us now, you and us, you and me now, if it was us now, like, someone asked us and we carry all our, all our burdens. I mean, I'm sure some of us would to an extent, but actually we fall under that, we break under that because we also have our own pressures, we also have our own oops, burdens to, to really carry. Um, but we have a God actually who carries everyone's, he already knows and he wants to be there for you. So, that's such a beautiful thing. So I'm gonna get the bus now, I get into town, it's too late for me to walk, or even ride my bike to be fair. I have to go upstairs and then get my uh, my basket. Uh, I don't think I showed you guys earlier, but I went to H&M earlier and I saw these really cute pair of trousers for like five pounds. They're like beige chinos, but they don't fit me, so I'm gonna return them. Um, yeah, sad times. But yeah, I'm gonna get the bus now and see if I can return it before meeting my friends for some pizza. It's really about to rain, wow. Vlog, okay, so... She's got the same idea. London! Hey! <laughs> So All we right, finally got away to the cafe. Pardon? No, go ahead. Go ahead. No, no. <laughs> We're basically at the cafe. <laughs> <Let's go. laughs> so yeah. So we thought we were at the right place, but actually we weren't. <laughs> so we're rushing to make our booking. Still got time though, so it should be fine. But we're gonna enjoy the view for a little while.
if you guys want to put drinks as well, because sure. I will, I'm happy to have tea, so like, um, so it comes with everything, we just have to pick the drink, right? Yeah, okay. it's unlimited. But then, yeah, I, I'm gonna order some some bits of food. So. Yeah. Um, I don't want the hot tea, I'm going to have peach iced tea, I think. You're going to have that. Do you want a nice tea? Can you drink iced tea? Hmm? Do you want iced tea? No. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I don't. I've not tried iced tea. Oh, really? It doesn't taste like tea. It's just normal. I think there's like... I've got two sides. That does look good. Yeah, but you know that I'm going to be punching the cake off. Do you guys know about milk? No. Like I'm making it strong. <laughs> See what? No, you can use that one. I've got some tons of soup. Oh, that's nice actually. Peach is actually really good. Yeah, the peach is nice, but it's a bit sweet for me because I use um I used to go to Starbucks one. Sorry, I won't look at you. You go to Starbucks one. So good. And Starbucks one has quite lots of syrup in there. This is really nice. Oh, this is really good. It's fruity. It's and you can poke the watermelon if you want. Do I have any pictures? Why well, does that make a difference? No, but I mean, you, you eat it when, <laughs> if it's real, anyways. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. Mm. I'm not doing very well. Let's see. Come in. <laughs> oh, is this? <laughs> What's this one? What's this one? I'll start moving now. I'm coming now. Hmm? Oh my. <laughs> okay. Okay. Do you think we need to get some extras? Mm, we'll see. Maybe we'll have to get some kimchi. What we can ask. We'll see what it looks like. I've never tried kimchi. Yeah. Try some. Yeah. Kimchi and a Oh. This is actually exciting. Uh, what huh? It's fermented cabbage. You won't like it. It's quite sour. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I love how she already knows. Yeah, it's, like, it's like it's an acquired taste. That's why. I didn't like it the first time I had it. But it does look. It does look good when you watch it. Do you know what I love about Korean dramas? The way they eat. Oh, yeah, they are. 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 Oh, and he's making this rice. Oh, the rice looks so good in that. And she just, as she finished it with a like, oh, yeah. It looked good. Yeah, yeah. And then she said, yeah, I know, right? Yeah. I really want to do that. Because that seems to be okay. No, the kimchi fried rice. I think your face seems to be acceptable. I mean, in dramas, yeah. But no one ever really eats that in real life. Unless you like. They don't. No. Oh, that's a shame. That's good. Just don't. Really? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> we're, so we're at Korean restaurant. Um, made our orders and we for it to come out, but it looks so cute in here. Nice and petite. It's back. <laughs> it was back. Thank you. So juicy. I wasn't expecting that Chantal either. No, I honestly that didn't go down well, very well. The chicken well. smell though. <laughs> if I didn't have what I just had, it would have smelled nicer, but. Yeah, you can't resist. Chantal. Hey. <laughs> Chantal. 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 So after we left the Korean restaurant, uh, we went to a bar slash restaurant called Drake and Morgan by King's Cross Station. It was nice, it was cute, I didn't really film anything else, but yeah, thank you for watching. <laughs>